Hello, Sus Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So I will be hopping right into y'all energy. I want you all to take what fits, see what does not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button and comment. Subscribe to the channel. Swap Rose is needed. Also, Sash Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank you for everything that y'all do to help the channel grow. I really love and appreciate you all. Okay, Sash, so I did pull out your general energy for this reading. And we had two cards that come out. We had two cards, which was the Star card and the High Priestess. Now, this is some extremely powerful energy, especially if you are a tarot card reader. I feel like your readings or your powers are being, like, amped right now, okay? They're just being amped. Um, now, for others, if you are not a tarot card reader or psychic, I feel as though you have um, been getting these downloads from a reader. Also, you could have faith in a reader. Um, but really I'm getting this is about a light worker to be honest okay this is a light worker that's having faith in him or herself and receiving very powerful extremely strong downloads from spirit okay and and is telling the truth here okay so this is for a light worker to be honest that's what I'm really getting now um like I said, some of you all, this could just be you where maybe you have faith in yourself. You're trying to become a reader, okay? Um, but you still are very powerful. Um, I feel like you guys are, some of you all are healing. Some of you all are healing through readers, healing through the messages, healing through the cards, okay? Some of you all are getting faith. Some of you all are getting these positive affirmation through these readers, right? Um, and that's making you become powerful. That's moving you here with the will of fortune, okay? So I feel like right now we got readers, we got viewers, we got everyone that has been moved here. Um, or becoming very powerful or believing in themselves. And good things are happening. Balance is happening. Um, it could be changes in love. It could be readings about love that is just on point. Or it could be um, where you're about to receive some sort of love after being tricked, after being lied to, after having your time, love, money, energy um, stolen by a thief. That's the truth. You're getting this clarity whether you are a reader or whether you are a person that's listening to the reader. Okay, but everyone right now is in some sort of healing, awakening energy. Everyone is right now is trying to figure out the best way to move forward from something. Everyone is trying to figure out the best way to get a breakthrough or the best way to get their happiness or the best way to get happiness and love, money, and life, right? Because I feel like there's been a lot of losses. Uh, there's been some thieves. There's been liars in your energy right that could have put you to um the rock bottom also it could be the thieves and the liars that's trying to get a breakthrough that's trying to change their life that's listening to these readers that's trying to have hope that's trying to change their lives when it comes to their health when it comes to their money when it comes to their love when it comes to balance because a lot of people have out here being in, have just out here been in despair People have been jobless, homeless, don't know how to feed their dog or cat or pet. Okay, a lot of people out here just looking at people not wanting to help them. Maybe gossiping or telling the truth about these people when it comes to their financial decision. A lot of people are homeless, okay? A lot of people don't have money to pay their bills or to know where the next meal is coming from, right? But whatever these truth is from this reader with this very strong star energy and high priestess energy is giving someone hope is giving someone um faith for a new beginning because a lot of people just is in despair out here jobless homeless oh my goodness what's this energy okay it's this these readers this reader this person I don't know okay but this this is a very powerful reader who gives someone hope 
someone very spiritual that brings in hope for others maybe bring in hope from him or herself okay so this is someone very powerful here this reader what's the energy yeah a lot of people are getting breakthroughs listening to this reader releasing toxic energy releasing red flags doing their research on toxic people, accepting the changes, accepting their growth, accepting their balance, accepting releasing, okay? Um, there could be some sort of wealthy man that's always brought up or woman here, um, but this wealthy man or woman is really a false person, okay? And this reader um, lets people know about this false person or shows the red flags in regards to these people. It could be some sort of older woman or it could be an older man where someone goes and it's always a temporary success or something okay and someone just ends up sad okay so this reader gives someone the hope to be in this queen of pentacles boss business owner new love energy okay and this person goes to this reader and watches this person or these people but also provides them with uh peace in their soul okay so these could be people that have anxiety or this could be a reader with anxiety. Just take it how it fit, okay? Uh, so you could be the healer. You could be the very powerful tarot card reader that believes in yourself to help these people in these situations. Or you could be going through this, okay? Um, now, give me more spirit. Definitely, I'm getting a queen of wands out here. So you could definitely be a Sag, of course. This is your reading. <laughs> but you also have Queen of Pentacles in you, which is boss business owner, committed individual um, that helps people change their life away from chaos to um, getting it going in the right direction. Maybe you've been in that situation before. You've had a tower, so you know how to help people that have had towers. You've been there before, and you changed. So you help other people change. Low vibrational people. Because you're an empress. Right? A lot of people that have a lot of inner conflict or turmoil with themselves. You help them. A lot of people that's fighting with themselves. You help to heal them. Oh, this is such a beautiful, powerful reading. This is a powerful reading too. That's what I'm getting. This is about to be a very powerful reading with that star card. And that high priestess card, right? So you help people recover their self and get back to a peaceful state, okay? Um, because you've been there if you are a light worker, okay? People that's feeling left out in the cold or in this five of pentacles energy, you, you're a very powerful person. You help people. You heal people. Um, give me more on this eight of wands in first. I feel like some people feel like you didn't have a gift or that you don't have a gift, right? So a lot of people could have underestimated this very powerful high priestess, uh, but then they came back to this high priestess for some help or some assistance, right? Because they know that this high priestess is the truth. They know this high priestess is intuitive as hell. So a lot of people question this person's integrity or their gifts or something. But a lot of people come back or they could have been a masculine if you are a reader. Some sort of Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, um, Taurus, Libra, some sort of air sign, maybe a Virgo. Okay, someone that could have been a fool and... Maybe someone when you were younger or someone that chose a younger energy. This person watches you now. Very overwhelmed. Okay. Or this is what the reader, the very powerful reader tells you that. That this person wants you. This person wants to be with you because you are the most powerful. You are the most intuitive. But they're going to have to accept how they had to heal you or left you out in the cold. Okay. So that's why you got this very powerful reader here. Okay, this is a good reading. Yeah. Somebody left somebody out in the cold here. They didn't know which way to go. They at one point felt like someone wasn't a main female or that someone wasn't somebody wasn't powerful. 
or that someone wasn't intuitive or that someone didn't know what they were talking about so they withdrew from someone they stopped investing in someone some sort of king of pentacles towards Virgo or Capricorn but now they want to come back to this person now they feel like this person is their main female and they want to recover here okay so this could be about you light worker or this could be about the readings that you give you could give love readings or you can help someone or this is just a tarot reader giving a very powerful message right now okay so yeah i feel like this person avoided the messages they didn't believe in a very powerful tarot reader but now they believe in you and now they want to come back to you they all they do is watch you talk about the truth you speak the truth <laughs> okay <laughs> You speak the damn truth and they want to come back, baby. Okay, but I feel like you're just focused on your single energy and building up your pinnacles. I feel like you let your guard down with this person and this person could have did something to where you didn't feel like this main female in this person's energy and you could have stopped talking to them. Um, maybe they could have chose a mother or siblings or third party energy. They could have ignored you. They cause you to be sad, but now they are sad because you're no longer stressed. You're in this great fortune energy. You've released yourself here with the four of pentacles. Okay, you're no longer holding on to this person with the four of pentacles in reverse. And they're very unfulfilled as you withdraw from them because they watch you, especially at nighttime. They watch you in the daytime too. This could be a family member or a friend. All right. So if anything resonates with you said, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Swat rolls if needed. And until next time, bye.